everybody, welcome to Hollywood, Los Angeles, California, along with the rock star, Ray Ferraro. Uh, I'm James Sabolski. Setters glide into position for the opening draw. Every game critical in the postseason, this one no different, and we are underway. Great stop, score! He hangs his head here, James. We look at it on the replay. He thought he stopped it, but he didn't get all of it, and it goes into the net. LA's got the game's opening goal, and it didn't take long. You always want to start quickly, but I don't think anybody really thinks it's going to be this fast. Moves it quickly over to Pasternak. Grabbed along the board by DeBrusk. Los Angeles takes possession along the wall. The Bruins grab possession to the puck. Chance in front! Stopped by the goaltender. Still plenty of time left in this frame. Los Angeles has the 1-0 lead. Offense is on face-off and he wins the draw. Boston's got the puck along the wall. Los Angeles has it near the wall. Moves it to Ben. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. Boston's got the puck against the boards. Picked up along the wall by Anderson. He carries the puck up along the wing. Here's a short pass to Smith. Quick snap. Oh, denies him with the save. I think he got the blocker on it. Sometimes you're in close. There's no room to put it anywhere. The goalie smothered it all. The Bruins scoop it up along the boards. Taken along the wall by Pasternak. Gaining momentum along the boards. Oh, he got clobbered. Man, did he ever. And to make matters worse, he's got a stick knocked out of his hands. Now he's got to go chase the twig down. Handles the puck at the point. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. From along the half wall, a shot denies him. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. Los Angeles leads it 1 0. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Georgiev is going to hang on to that one for a whistle. Along the right side into the offensive zone. And that goes off a player. LA is looking to break out of their own end. Oh, he laid a solid hit on him there. There, but regains control of the puck. Boston to DeBrusk. Use quick pass to Rask. He clearly takes the feed at center and moves forward. Here's a chance. Oh, what a save with the stick by Murray. I like the goalie's positioning here. He was aggressive enough to make a save on a dangerous chance. He took a pretty solid jolt there, James. Uh, we're going to have to check in on him in a second. And he's going after him. Oh, it looks like the trainer's going to meet him at the door here. He's struggling to get off the ice, just trying to get to the bench. Levels him with the hit into the offensive zone. And he slides it quickly to DeBrusque. And a smart heads-up read to come up with the puck. They score! This seemed like an inevitability here. Once a delayed penalty arm goes up, it seems like the defending team just fell back on their heels. They didn't do anything really to slow down the opposition. Get to the net, that's where the goals are. The rebound sits there and he puts it away. The Kings win possession here in the open ice. Well, that'll get a response. And here we go, buckle up. him and sends him down to the ice. That's a clear decision there. The Kings and their fans are pretty excited about the way that fight went. Now we'll see if they can take advantage of the momentum.
Los Angeles has it near the wall. Moves it quickly over to Anderson. Here's the pass. Pops it in for the go-ahead goal. Control the game now. You finally got the lead. You worked so hard to get in front. Don't give it up now. Man, the goalie's going to look at his teammates and say, is anybody going to cover the high slot? He was so open, he was able to hammer home the one-timer. Moves it to the cross. Slides the puck over. Here's a shot. Scores! They barely fished the puck out after the last one. Two goals in 70 seconds. That sure changes things here on the ice. Yeah, the game has completely been turned upside down. He's playing the percentages. Drops into the butterfly, but it doesn't help him. He gets beat pretty cleanly. For safety. Los Angeles takes possession along the wall. Wow. He scores! What a shot! What a pass! He swept this one up over the goalie's glove. The room wasn't there until the goalie dropped into the butterfly, maybe a little early. Opened up some space up top. job locking up his opponent let's it fly oh what a save by murray he scores that didn't take long now the coaches get uh, the chance after giving up a goal they make a change he puts the right guys on the ice because they go right back down the ice and score if you can work yourself in that close to the net and then get loose man you're just hoping somebody can find you he won times that for a goal This has to be on the net. Chase made this part of his game. He levels his opponent here. On the wing. And they can't connect. Boston's got the puck in the defensive end. Oh, he'll feel all of that after this one. He was locked in there. That's in a dangerous spot. He makes a good save here. Late goings of this period. LA's doubled up on them. It's now 4-2. The Kings win the draw. Puts the puck on net! Scores! They score back-to-back -back goals. They stay aggressive after getting the first one. They tack another one on here. He didn't have much room up over the glove, but as soon as the goalie dropped into the butterfly, there was enough for him to put it into the top bin. down but not out they've had chances they just haven't capitalized winding down the final minute of this opening frame huge steal in his own end a little more patient with the puck no need to try that play nice pass and that one's turned away Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. Los Angeles wins the draw. Denied by Murray. High quality chance, high quality save. And now it's over to Richie. Slides it to DeBrusque. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. Here he is, shot right in front. Stopped by the goaltender. Another look at this. That's a good shot, but the goalies get the blocker up to make the save. Offense his own face off, and he wins the draw. Tremendous stop by Georgiev. 
LA's got it in their own zone. The Bruins gain control of the puck against the wall. An easy glove save made by Georgiev. Quick hands, not only does he get a glove on it, he catches it, which is hard to do. Now, positionally, he's in the right spot here. That's a hard shot. He made it look rather easy. The Bruins win the faceoff. Sends the pass over. And that banks off a stick as the puck skips into the crowd to one lucky fan. We'll get a faceoff here on the ice. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Oh, how did he come up with that stop? There's the horn. It might as well be someone yelling uncle to conclude this first period. What a demolition. Are you looking for information on the stars of tomorrow? As both teams get a breather here in this first intermission, we'll do the same and get ready for period number two. Both teams back on the ice are lined up and period number two is about ready to go. A one-sided affair after the first 20 minutes. Here we go for period number two. And as he opts to freeze the puck, we get a... Oh, he's trying to box him out. This is getting a little testy. Ben's looking around for somebody to fight. He's going to have to go and fill the dance card somewhere else. The Bruins haven't had a lack of scoring opportunities, but they are still behind on the scoreboard. Los Angeles takes possession off the faceoff. The Bruins have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Pass across to Carlson. Couldn't find the intended target. Here comes the pushback. Puck picked up by Graves. Can't find his man. Tension's rising. Didn't take much to get this heated up. And here we go. That's the end of that spirited boat. The Kings still like to add on to the momentum gained with that fight. The building is really perked up. Centering pass! Rocks him on the play. Nice zone entry from the right side. Here's a shot. Oh, what a blocker stop. Wait, they're signaling a goal. It, it, it looked like he had it, but it looks like they're signaling a goal now. It's hard enough to be the goalie when you have to stop the shot. This thing's like a rubber ball. It's bouncing all over the place and somehow ends up behind the goalie. That's a tough break for him. The Bruins have it behind the cake. Boston's got the puck along the board. Ben's used all of his weight to lay this hit along the board. Really? And hit while well, a challenge me. There's the call. She's able to get everything behind this hit. He really lays one on. The right wing, he moves into the middle. Long pass up ahead to center. I need to take another look at that. I thought there was room to get by. To Smith. So Moves right to the middle. And just out of arm's reach on the play. Tripped up on the play and the referees caught that one. Gets to the bench for the extra attacker. Time for the official to pass down his sentence. 
And tripping looks to be the call, Ray. Really a frustrating penalty to take because you're just fishing for the puck. You get your stick in the wrong spot, the guy goes down and you're toast every time. Batten down the hatches, things should open up here with a little four on four on the ice. The last couple of years we've seen different strategy four on four come into the game. What is apparent when you get the puck, he scores! On the one-timer, two sweep! Oh man, he turned that over, James. What a bad play. Problem with it is it gives the shooter all kinds of time to find where he wants to shoot it. He sticks it right up under the bar. Gains the zone from the right. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. A chance right in front. Scores! All over the rebound and he puts it in. You want money, you go to the bank. You want bread, you go to the store. You want goals, you get into the net. The rebound's there, he puts it away. Well, he's calling him out now. Yeah, after the teammate got hurt, he jumped right in. He's gonna make him try and pay a price. We got ourselves a fight here. Him and sends him down to the ice. That's a clear decision there. Well, the fans were cheering. It was so loud down here when the fight started. Not so much anymore as their guy didn't do so well. That's a long time to sit in the penalty box when the game is tied and you've just taken a penalty to put your team short. There's the go-ahead goal, and we have a new game! Taking the lead now, you control it. You push the pace, you push the other guys back on their heels. This is a really good place to get lost on the ice. The defensemen are down low defending. The forwards are worried about the point. If you can find this high slot play, you often are going to get a one-timer. The Bruins get in front here in the second. It's been a pretty tight game, not much on either side, but they've got the lead now. Bends one possession. Puck grabbed by Doughty. Takes it into the slot. Scores! The captain delivers! When you get into this position, that puck's got to be off your stick in a hurry. You don't have much time to think about it. Ben's sure been fun to watch tonight. He's got three points in the game already. He says... Shea's going to play it near the point. Quick shot. Scores! The deadlock's broken. That's a big goal, and they put him into the lead. You're not aiming your deflection, you're just trying to change the direction of it. This beats the goalie because he can't catch up to the puck changing direction. Here comes the pushback. Richie's not interested in dropping the mitts and going at it. They're gonna have to look at him immediately. He's just slowly working his way to the bench, James. McAvoy's going to try and shake this off and get back into the game, but he took a heavy hit there. De Simone. Lost. Strong. Boston's not taking their foot off the pedal. They've been aggressive this entire play. 
Here's an offensive chance. Answers the call big time. What a stop by Georgiev. Putting the hard hat on here. What a hit. Look out. Stop by the goaltender. He scores. Three goals. The hat trick's in the bag. Here come the hat. What a great feeling as this place is jumping. The rebound snapped away. What a nice shot. But the goalie's got to do a better job cleaning up that rebound. You can't leave it right there. Tight. Dropped up. Second period nearly into its final minute here. Moves it on over to Sherratt. Takes the feed. Pokes it away in his own end. They fight for it along the boards. Richie's on the attack in the offensive zone. L.A. is moving it along the wing. They've got numbers. Here's the pass. Oh, if there's going to be a regret in this one, that might be it. Yeah, that play is right there to be had. They just missed the pass. The scoring chance goes away. Boston's got it behind the net. Gaining momentum along the wing. Boston's got the puck along the wall. Forces the turnover. Los Angeles moves ahead with the puck. And now he passes up to Heinen. Slides the puck over. Back at the point, they set it up. Right in the slot, and they can't connect. Passes it over to Donskoy. Well, not exactly a banner night for the goaltenders as the second period comes to an end. At least they'll get a breather here. Big third period still to come. We'll get ready for it. Hope you'll join us. Boston's going to have to finish up tonight's game one skater short. Their injured player will not return. Thanks very much for the update, Ray. Well, that certainly changes things now. Yes, it does. Third period. We are all tied up. And the next goal could be a biggie. Here's a shot, and he comes up with it. Boston's got the puck along the wall. Picking up some steam at center ice. Jabs the puck away. Los Angeles gains a hold of it. Looking for space inside the D zone. And it's a quick pass to Ben. Takes the feed. Shot comes up with the stop. Right on the doorstep. Grabbed along the board by Ben. A little rock'em sock'em on the play. The Kings gain possession along the wall. And as he stumbles, he coughs up the puck. Dishes it to DeBrusque. Moves it quickly over to Richie. Coughs it up at center. Oh, he almost put him through the boards. It's the boards. And now it... Teams have been going at each other since the very beginning of this hockey game. LA's got the puck. And a lot of times you get busy and worn down. I think that's why you jump on it, freeze it in a close game. Oh, that's a good look from the guys in the truck there. The Bruins are on the attack. This one, big time stop. The Kings get a hold of the puck. Richie's working it around in the corner. And we got a leader as he tucks it into the net. These teams are jammed together. That goal might open it up. James, when they look at the film tomorrow, that's not going to look very good. That's a pretty bad error that led to that goal against. Well, that'll get a response. Open for him. He's going to need some help. That one stung, and he's slow to get himself back together here, James. I want to look at that again. Take it along the wall by Anderson. 
Anderson. Yeah, the officials didn't like that. The arms are in the air. There's the whistle, and the officials set to give the call. Shillington's getting called for slashing. The sound the slash makes off the equipment alerts the referee. If you're going to slash him, look for the spot with no padding. The setters will glide into the dot. LA's got it in the offensive zone. Here's a backhand. Scores! And boom! Goes the you-know-what, Ray. Yeah, the dynamite line blows up again. What a beautiful goal. Oh, that's just critical. You control the puck off the faceoff and before the penalty killers can really get set. You've worked the puck for a shot. This time it's in the net. We are back underway. He gains control of the puck. Well, a challenge being laid here. Here we go. James, I was really good at this. Not the fight part. I mean the first part where someone else comes in and fights for you. <laughs> Oh, and he caught him right there, and that'll pretty much do it. Yeah, that's not going to go to the judges. The Kings still like to add on to the momentum gained with that fight. The building is really perked up. Another look at this one, James. This looks like it hurts. I feed to Heinen. Step regains control of the puck. Moves it quickly over to Simone. And he can't find his man. LA is moving it up the ice. Slides it across. That's in. He scores. And the bench jumped right up. Both teams know the longer you stay locked in the time, luck starts to play a bigger part of the victory. They're going to love the way this goal played out on the odd man rush. They got out into the open ice, moved the puck quickly, and were able to finish it off. This puck into the corner out of danger. Oh. Here they come on the attack. Passes right to the front. Stopped by the goaltender. He scores! What an effort. They keep staying at the game. They push. They're looking for the tying goal. They finally get it. Man, his teammate could get rich with passes like this. What a move that opens up everybody. And then he lays off and a simple one for him. Sideways. Here's a rip. Oh, what a stop. There's not much time left here as you get into the final 20 minutes. The game's close. A mistake now would be critical. Let's go back and take a look at why this game is still. Handles the puck. And he's tripped up on the play. Referee's hand goes up here. Let's get the official decision. Ray, it looks like tripping. It's amazing how coaches get angry with a tripping penalty but they don't seem to say much if it's a boarding penalty. It's still two minutes. Two is two, yeah. Benz won the draw here in the offensive zone. Off a stick. Puck wrapped by Sherratt. And they'll get it out of the defensive end. Los Angeles gains a hold of the puck against the boards. Here's a chance on the doorstep. Shot in front. Denies him. On their heels, trying to clear. Big defensive play on that clear. Now puck's got to get out, especially late. He does a nice job here. LA's in now. Sends it across. He scores! Well, they break the tie here, James. This game had been hotly contested since it's been level. They now have found a way to jump into the lead. It doesn't 
doesn't happen very often on the power play, but they get out on an odd man rush, move the puck around well, and score on a rush. Well, you know, I won't complain. This shot comes from a real dangerous area on the ice. But the goalie's in position. Another stop by the goaltender. Move to the middle. Oh, what a missed chance that was. Yeah, he's got to make a better play there. He's done everything. And that's the hat trick. Listen to this place. And here come the hats. I love this tradition, although I will tell you, they collect the hats up. They used to give them to us, and you're like, what am I going to do? I'm not wearing somebody else's hat. That's just a minute between goals. Wow, insane how quick that was. Bang, bang. Yeah, the defending team just couldn't put a stake in the ground. They couldn't stop them. The Bruins have the puck now. Fires it on net. And that shot gets caught in traffic. The Kings move to the offensive zone. And it comes up with the save. Scoops up the puck now. Sends it over to DeBrusque. Here's a chance. Takes a shot. Scores! The pinball type goal. That would be a perfectly placed shot. It hits the inside of the goal post and into the net. Oh, they're going to look at this on video and not be very happy with it. They turned the puck over, and now the odd man rush develops. They can't get back to stop it. You can almost see the difference in the bench and the body language. They know they've got a chance. Puck scooped up by Carlson. Quick pass to DeBrusque. Under a minute to go in the third. Boston's gained possession along the boards. Shot! Stops it with a glove! Georgiev's under fire, and he's going to hang on for the whistle. Sometimes you freeze it to give your teammates a breather. Sometimes you freeze it so you get yourself one. He's been really busy tonight, but he's been exceptionally sharp. The Bruins are running out of time as they trail late in this third period. Buck is dropped, and we are back underway. Doughty stick handling in his own zone. Scooped up along the wall by Anderson. Sends a pass over. And he slides it quickly to Ben. Fires towards the Whoa. empty net. Empty net goal. That should be the night, Razor. Yeah, everybody jumps up in the seats, too. I mean, this thing is pretty well over. That should be enough to wrap this thing up. The empty net goal should seal it. The Kings make their way back to center ice, probably breathing a little easier here now, Ray. Pretty much puts this to bed. The empty netter gives them a little bit more of a comfortable lead. Hull has won it, and now it's grabbed by Carlson. Boston's goalie is on the bench. The extra attacker has jumped into the play. Oh, what a save by Georgiev. Here's a short pass to Anderson. Tries to get it over towards the empty net. And that should do it as he puts it into the empty net. You ever notice how nobody ever really celebrates an empty net goal, but inside they're like, yes, I scored. I'm thinking you probably parted for your team. Oh, look, look. <laughs> Well, now you got a couple of goal lead here with the empty netter. That should be enough to put this away. The setters will glide into the dot. Pence won the draw here in the open ice. Sent into the offensive zone. The Bruins scoop it up along the boards. That's it. There's the final horn to close this one up. How 
big is that win tonight to break that deadlock? All the pressure goes to your opponents. I mean, it's such a critical, pivotal game. This game five always seems to have a big impact on a series. It's a foreign concept to think that players like the Rocket or Mr. Hockey would have done this way back when. No, but they wouldn't have done this. It's a regular occurrence now. But now things have changed, and this is what you should do. In short, you simply have to love playoff hockey. For Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Thanks so much for joining us this evening.